Hey, thanks again for sending in questions related to our recent sermons. This last Sunday, we began a new series in the Minor Prophets, and we started with Hosea. Of course, Hosea um, includes a story of God asking Hosea to go marry and love Gomer, um, who is an unfaithful woman in her marriage. So the question is this week, one, how could God ask Hosea to do uh, something so difficult? And two, if, if Hosea and Gomer are really meant to be a metaphor of God and his love for his church, if God also using Gomer, um, is she just a prop in his, um, in his metaphor? Um, so we'll, ask, we'll answer the second one first. Um, is God just using Gomer? I would say the answer is absolutely not. Um, how amazing is it that um, God would send someone like Hosea into someone like Gomer's life? Isn't that what we all need? Wouldn't we want God to send somebody like Hosea into each one of our lives, someone who is radically for us, even when we um, are unfaithful and broken. We have a constant presence in our life, loving us like God loves us. Um, you know, a, a tangible, uh, physical person that we can um, hug and uh, hear and see, loving us how God loves us. That is an incredible blessing. Um, in Gomer's life. And so absolutely not is she being used in some way. She's being ministered to. Um, God's grace in her life is sending her Hosea. And I pray each one of us has a Hosea uh, in our lives. And now the second question um, about Hosea is how could God ask Hosea to do uh, su such a difficult thing? Um, tie himself to someone who's going to break his heart. Um, of course, we're not sure. One of the commentaries I read was if uh, suggested if, if Hosea is going to be um, a representative of God on the earth. He's going to speak for God. That's what prophets do. They tell people what God is like. Um, then it would be helpful to Hosea to have a lived experience of what God is experiencing. So Hosea could feel all the ups and downs <laughs> that God feels, and then he could accurately convey those to the people. Um, as, as always, you know, we have, we have more empathy for uh, people in other situations if we have been through those ourselves, and we can articulate what they are feeling better if we have been through something similar. And so God may be giving Hosea um, a situation like he has in order for Hosea to be able to faithfully communicate what it is uh, that God is thinking and feeling in his relationship with us. So thanks for the question. Hope that helps. We'll see you next time.